Hey, Rubble. Good day, good evening, it's what, almost nine there, thanks for joining, nice man, cooking up curry, we were just talking about curry, alright, let's uh, come up with some more curry music then, the shirt of the day is, behold, the octopus. Got to see them again, man. Hope to get to see them again. All right. Uh, some curry drumming. Let's see. What can we come up with? How about... Well, since I don't have to worry about what key it's in. There we go.
That is a Korg wave drum. You can hear if I do this, that's all it sounds like. It's a very fun drum.
You know, I need to get uh, active on streaming on some other sites too. I think. I think. That's maybe a little too sharp there. The uh, backing stuff is Novation Launchpad on a little iPad Mini. It's got all kinds of cool little things in there. And you can send your own samples to it. I haven't gotten around to doing that. I really should do that. <laughs> that would be cool. I wouldn't mind having the big... There's, a, there's an actual launch pad that they make that is tactile and has... You know, has lights under the buttons and all that. And boy, I love stuff like that. And the wave drum here is is just a blast. Berserker6722, thank you for joining us. I don't know what you just said there. I'll have to look that up later. <laughs> but hello, thanks for joining. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, uh, my friend Carl made me some... Some... Uh, loops, or not some loops, some um, clips of my videos to put on like, um, you know, Facebook and, and, uh, hey, wow, man, yeah, it's pretty loud, isn't it, to put on Facebook and uh, YouTube, and I just started messing with the settings here to make it a little bit better as far as the, as far as the, the video quality, because it was looking really crappy before. Hello from Michigan, Todd Fargus one Wow, from Michigan, I got a lot of relatives in Michigan. My wife has a lot of relatives in Michigan. Thank you for joining. I'm currently just kind of warming up with some improvisation here and enjoying the Korg wave drum. I haven't really, I've had it set up for the last week or so and I really have barely done anything with it. So kind of having some fun improvising around whatever ideas that gives me today or tonight. So uh, thank you for joining. Um, I'm going to continue with the looping and, and playing. Thank you. 
That's supposed to be a tap dancer and somebody with the uh, castanets or finger cymbals. Gotta find something that I wanna try. What is it? Uh-huh. Oh, this thing. I could just play the uh Mr. Fargus, you are my first subscriber. Thank you so much. That, uh, that is awesome. Thank you. Thank you so much. I uh, really enjoy doing these as it's uh, 
It's affording me a freedom that I don't get in most of the gigs that I do, which are, uh, you know, there's nothing wrong with playing straight and simple stuff, obviously, um, because it does well. Gets you lots of jobs and lots of uh, straight on stuff, man. Nice, thanks. This is awesome. Well, you guys are making my night already. Um, I didn't. I wasn't even sure if I was going to do one tonight because I was just a little worn out. So I took a nap. <clears throat> took a nap, and then here I am again. Glad I came on. Let's see. Yeah. So this is the uh, the Korg Wave Drum. The thing with this drum is, it has, can you still hear me good? Okay. So basically this thing's got one pressure sensor right here, and then another pressure sensor under this part right here, and then it's got three transducers around the, around the edge. So um, you can probably hear it, um, like uh, if you listen closely, when I hit the snare drum, this thing actually resonates because it's it works very much like a like a microphone, so I'll demonstrate. Just in sympathetic ring, it catches this pretty well. So I'll do it again, but, but this time I'll, I'll mute. I'll hit it with and then hit it without and you'll hear. So yeah, that uh, this thing is pretty beefy. Ah, very good. Uh, I did move the light. I moved it a little more overhead. So that's good. I got my first subscriber here, Mr. King. Uh, that would be Todd Fargus there, number one. You are number one, Todd Fargus. <laughs> Literally in this in this uh, instance. So yeah. <laughs> Yeah, so that, that, that snare sound was a uh, sympathetic off of the uh, off of the wave, the hoav, the hoav drum, and it does a lot of different sounds. A lot of like that's the '80s tom sound there. That works great if you're going to play a Prince song or... Oh, I like this one. I'm going to try this one for a bit. yesterday to the um, affiliate business I see it looks like some of that is being utilized right now very good number one and uh, now we're messing with the Yamaha EAD 10 to give us some different sounds on on the drums um, 
This one might be too obnoxious to keep going for too long, but we'll see. Uh, it's the Jingle Kick patch. That would be the speed metal setting on the EAD, which is more clicky than I feel like doing right now. So we'll try something else. When I get settled in the new place, we'll be playing around with different configurations on the kit, because I've got all kinds of other setups that I can do. You know, great big huge kick drum or smaller kick drums. I've got a rototom setup, which is fun. <laughs> um, all sorts of electronics, octobands, um, fun stuff. We can really mix it up, but uh, right now everything's getting packed up because we're getting ready to move. And uh, so soon, soon, um, yeah, so let's do some more. I've already been almost an hour, that's good. I'm going to try some more, uh, just a little more improv and playing around with, with this thing here.
That's an idea. Let's do that. Um, I did this a few weeks ago and it worked out really well. I just uh, I took theme variations from my audience. If you have any suggestions for a theme for me to think of while I'm while I'm improvising, so whatever whatever you come up with, I'll be thinking of that while I'm trying to represent it or help it influence what I'm playing. So we were doing that started off with the uh, curry. <laughs> Cooking curry was the theme, and now, well, the curry's been cooked, so so now it's time to uh, do another another theme. What should my theme be? Does anybody have an idea? I'm gonna noodle around while you while you come up with an idea. Give me give me a theme. But emotes, yeah. I don't have any emotes yet, do I? Or I haven't even looked at what's available on here. But I need to make some. That would be fun. Okay. Space? Alright. Alright. The theme is space.
that was fun. It was fun for me, at least. Looks like you guys... Sounds like you liked it. Carl's over there representing it in text. A water phone. Water phone, is that one of those... Um, I think that's something that I want. Nope, Carl wasn't enjoying that. He didn't enjoy that at all. Isn't the water phone like uh, have that... Have like a body at the... Uh, like a reservoir at the bottom and a, and a neck. Kind of looks like a bong with tines coming off of it. So you can play it with a... With a um, bow. Is that what that is? A uh, water phone? Is that what you're talking about? Yeah, those things. I want one of those bad. I'm sure I've mentioned I'm a bit of a hoarder as far as instruments go and all that. Oh, you got to play one before. Oh, that was cool. I've never gotten to play one. I've never gotten to see one in person, I don't think. Maybe, maybe one time. But I didn't get to play around with it. All right, what's our next theme? What are we gonna do? Yeah, I bet that was, I bet that was fun. All right, next theme. I'm gonna change sounds here, we'll figure out. Does anybody have an idea for a theme for me to improvise to? Infected water? Okay, we can do infected water. I know he wasn't suggesting you weren't suggesting a theme, were you? But I'm going to do one. And uh, I didn't tell you, Carl, but this is a, the the shirt of the day is "Behold the Octopus." It's a very good shirt, but uh, I would like to have one in a uh, better size for me. Okay, infected water is the is the theme. Yeah. Okay. Okay, infected water.
Hey now. Wow, those are like a... I keep saying I need to stuff those with foam or something so that they don't make that sound, but it's kind of pleasing. It's like its own instrument. <laughs> Very low-key instrument. All right, so that was infected water then. Yes. Well, wait. <laughs> what do you mean, did I thank Rumpel? Yeah, Rumpel's been... Rumpel was thanked before you even got here, man. What are you talking about? Because are you... Do you think he infringed upon your... Upon your idea? Because he said he... He was merely reinforcing your idea. Even though I think you were making a joke. But it doesn't matter. What's our next theme? Is the next theme 420? That could be a theme, too. Um, especially if we have this thing going on. Because it does have lots of very stony kind of things, doesn't it? Ooh, this one sounds beefy. <laughs> <laughs> 